All right, you guys, so in this video, I thought I'd uh, show you the updated uh, procedure to do an on site compensation with a new Ferro Focus premium scanner. The prerequisites are the scanner has to be on, has to have the local uh, access point uh, Wi Fi on. Mine does. I am using a Apple device, a big iPad, but you can do this on your phone if it's your iPhone or if it's an Android device. Um, all you need is the stream app. So first of all, let me make sure that I'm actually connected to the scanner, which I am not, but I'll connect it here. So now I should be connected to the actual scanner. Let me swipe over to my Ferro stream app. Fires up the app. Shows me the last project that I was actually in. But I don't care about the project. What I need is I need to tap the top right over here, where it shows me the individual scanners. For some reason, mine decided to show the two scanners that are identical to each other. But uh, the idea is, uh, if you click the little triple dot next to each one of these, uh, you'd be surprised and you'd say, well, I don't want to edit IP. You need to swipe uh, the scanner to the left and that makes it show up. So what I want to do is, it's the left icon over here. One is refresh and one's um, uh, the on-site compensation. So I'll just touch the on-site compensation and it tells you what to do. Uh, generally no targets like what you see behind me are necessary anymore um, just have a room which has plenty of contrasting features no mirrors or massive uh, you know glass surfaces around just set it up on a tripod not too high not too low uh, one extension on the tripod that we have and just hit the start button and uh, get ready to get out of the way because it'll start scanning so um, hitting start and you will see that the scanner will start uh, doing its thing for the compensation. All right. It's now back finished and I'm just waiting for it to actually process the data and you can see that it's saying that the compensation is being processed and should see results in about a minute, as it says right now. Okay. Uh, no report. You don't get a report anymore. It's just a statement that uh, the quality and the meta information are all valid, uh, passed and all you do is just the, hit the OK button. Uh, that way it embeds it into the actual scanner and you can be uh, reassured that your scanner is uh, within its operating limits and uh, parameters. And if you have any questions or comments, leave them below.